So hey friends, my daughter wanted a little bit more of an adventure than the last river that we went on last weekend. So we're here in Oklahoma and she's going to attempt to raft down the Washita River. How do you feel about this? I'm excited. I'm ready for a river trip for sure. All right. Well, hopefully this all works out. Hopefully I can find the takeout to pick her back up in about five hours. Yeah, we brought a bigger boat. Well, I really hope this is a good idea. Um, Jesse did stop and talk to these people here that have a, it's a tubing company, shuttle tubing. He said that they're not open right now because the water's too high. Um, it, it turns it from a class two to about a class three plus, if you know what that means. Um, Jesse is a class five whitewater raft guide, so this should be okay, but it's really windy and I just hope all goes well. You taking your tube too? Yeah, just in case. Just in case, huh? Yeah. All right. Prepared. Back up. Yeah, I don't know, man. I guess she knows what she's doing. I mean, she has been doing this for about 10 years, so I'm sure she knows what she's doing. Good luck. So I'm trying to find the river where I can sit and watch Jess go by and I haven't found the river but I found some ducks along the side of the road. <laughs> So she should be coming by here in about an hour, I think. So, just gonna hang out, see if she floats by. Uh, yeah. Tells you a lot about the neighborhood. Egads. So I'm just sitting here on the side of the river waiting for Jesse to float by. <laughs> a car just pulled up and asked me directions. I'm like, um, if you're on the river, it's that way. <laughs> I don't know where, I don't know where I am. I'm somewhere in Oklahoma. I am not at all sure how long it'll take her to float down this far. Really no idea. Uh, I guess I'll sit here for about an hour though. Well, I guess I'll sit here till she goes by. <laughs> However long that takes. <sighs> Good times. Here she comes. Yeah, so she is going about two and a half miles an hour, it seems. Yeah, the 
this is Joe Exotics Ranch, y'all. <laughs> Wish I could find the kid. She's on the river still. It's getting late. I'm getting a little worried. So I've been running around for about two and a half hours trying to figure out how to get this kid off this river and I cannot find a way to get my van down there. Keep coming to lock gates. So I hope that she will come on down to this 56 bridge that we passed over earlier. I put our flag out there so hopefully she'll come on down here and she can get out. It's brutally hot out. I'm glad I said that third bottle of water with her. So there is a way to get up here. I can't drive the van down there though. It is a four wheel drive road for sure. If even that, you have to have mud tires. <sighs> Hope my flag didn't blow away. Put a rock on top of it. There's the flag. Hopefully she will find it. Thank goodness she made it. I just saw her going under the bridge to get off and then another guy pulled in to go down there I think to pick somebody else up. So maybe he'll drive her up this hill. <laughs> anyway, I am just so relieved she's back. I think she had fun. Yep, I'm not going down there. Nope, I'm not. That's how you get a van stuck, going down there. So was it fun? Yeah, I would say the trip was a success. Okay, well you're here, you're alive, and I'm relieved. 